Hello again, my name is Bruce Clow. I run Cirrus L Beekeeping Supplies. Today I want to talk about boxes or supers or on the South Island they call them stories. Now this is the standard Langstroth depth uh, box or super. Now the thing with a standard Langstroth depth uh, super is that when it's full of honey it weighs close to 40 kilograms. So people are looking for ways to reduce the weight when they're having to work the hives. So one way is to start reducing the depth of the box. So here we go from a what's called a full depth to a three quarter then a half depth box. Another way of dealing with the weight is to reduce the size of the box in this direction. So here we've got an eight frame hive box and here we got what I call a slim line. It takes five frames so it's half the equivalent of a full depth. The other thing about these boxes is that we can use different materials to make them. These ones that you see here are what we call commercial grade timber. The box can have a knot in it but it'll be a tight knot with no hole going right through. Premium grade timber, there's no knots in it and it's just a nice clean grain. So the front of this would probably be premium grade. Now besides the standard untreated pine, we can also use some treated materials and some specially uh, reconstructed wood. This is something I'm particularly fond of. This is called thermal wood. Basically it takes the pine, it cooks it in a kiln at about 200 degrees and an oxygen free atmosphere and it cooks all the wood sugars so that the bugs and fungi don't have anything that they can thrive on. So this box made out of thermal wood will last all a long, long time uh, without having to be treated. You probably would want to paint it for aesthetics and also to seal the outside so it doesn't absorb moisture, but that is a nice wood. The only issue with thermal wood is that it can be brittle. So here we use staples, so it's a very small uh, diameter injection, but if you're using nails or screws, you'd want to pre-drill all the holes because this wood, having been cooked, is brittle. Another option is a special treatment called TAN-E or copper azole is the more generic term. It uses uh, water as the transmitter to carry copper into the wood. And this copper is infused right through the wood and that copper is an antifungal agent but the elemental copper is no problem for the bees. So that's one way that you can actually purchase these uh, products as well. And as you can see, you can buy the boxes pre-made or you can buy kit sets which you can put together yourself. So this is a commercial grade, three-quarter depth, tanny kit set box ready for you to assemble.